the, the top point of the world, uh, we try to create a space as if we reach and achieve being on the top of the mountain. So in that space, it's very simple and clean, and we try to make spacious areas like tall ground lobbies, uh, the amenities are upgraded. For the peak, uh, we focus on upgrading the ground lobby. It's a special feature for uh, the peak because it's the moment when people arrive and they enter the lobby. So we want to make it more grandeur, uh, more luxury in material. Also, the detailing is more refined. Then connecting the lobby to the landscape and landscape to architecture, one of the main inspiration for the ground lobby is the concept of water. Because the series of towers uh, from the bottom up, we end with the idea of water and waterfall taken from the landscape design. With waterfall, we try to create inside the space uh, details of nature, the lighting chandelier like raindrops, the wall detail in the stone like uh, the waterfall. All these uh, elements create kind of a very uh, relaxing, beautiful indoor landscape. As for Lobby B, it's more connected to the waterfall. So in there, we bring that element into Lobby B by creating the chandelier to be like raindrops and trickling water. For our design, we created the lobby for residents to enjoy. Before we tried to uh, create the public amenities to have more and more functions, but now we focus on something very simple. It's the point of entry. So this is a, a space that each resident can go into different lobbies and enjoy uh, the different atmosphere, sit and look at the landscape to see the waterfall or the park. So the lobby is now a feature for the residents to enjoy.